Because I don't like the looks of this. Random rate of fire, 1 to 0.5. Oh. If I add that, I'll like bullet hose everything. But let's add some more attack and some more bullets. Actually, attack. Actually, bullets. Plus three, plus four. Oh, yeah. Attack plus six. Range plus three. Bullets plus four. Yes. 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 Um, let's get rid of the MA4F for now. We don't need it. Move. Boom. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking A. I call this gun Excalibur. Not Excalibur. Alright, so... We're not supposed to be in the police station. We figured this out. Can we go back to Carnegie Hall? Carnegie Hall! No special treatment. I only, only hope this city's got, asshole. Fuck off. And your little dog, too. What about the museum? Yep! So, where to? Is there any place for the research facility? Research facility? I'd like to conduct an experiment and test something. It might be relevant. How's the yeah. How about the facility in the museum where Clamp is at? They had really expensive equipment there. Extensive, not expensive. Yeah. No way, man. Anywhere but there. He should have been evacuated by now. It should be okay. Uh, yeah, that sounds good. Daniel, is that okay? I'm expecting a big tip for this. Haha, <laughs> cab driver joke. So this is the American Museum of Natural History. It's just as I imagined. You imagined it? I can find a research facility in this building? Yeah, hopefully we won't run into the jerk who runs it. Since he's been evacuated, it should be empty. Hmm, for a lab in the museum, it does have fairly extensive equipment. So what do you want to test? Yes, yes, of course. Let me see. I was able to extract a gel-like substance from Aya's clothing. Gel? Is it from Eve? Yes, it appears to be a remnant of Eve's cells. At the cellu cellular level, her power cannot be as strong as Aya said previously. Ow. Hey, what are you doing? I just want to conduct this experiment to see whether or not... Hmm, yes, yes, this is exactly as I... It's just as I thought. Go ahead, take a look. What is it? Wow, that's some sh fucking awesome zooming that things got. Awesome magnification. Yeah, that's really good magnification for a little <laughs> micros. What? It's just a microscope. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Your cells are completely surrounded by them. 
As you can see, the mitochondria or Eve has taken over the nucleus. In a similar manner, the beast that attacked you probably experienced the same thing. Does the mitochondria really have the power to control the nucleus? No, the normal mitochondria never has such power. But Eve's mitochondria has gone through tremendous evolutionary changes. This is what I think happened to Eve's mitochondria. Normally, mitochondria require oxygen when they generate energy called ATP. So at this time, the mitochondria requests oxygen from the nucleus. Without the energy supply from the mitochondria, the nucleus cannot function. So in essence, the two organelles constantly rely on each other. But in this case, it seems that Eve developed the power to reverse this symbiotic relationship. Evolution, or even mutation, seems likely in this case. Reverse the cycle? Look at this. Even with a limited number of cells, her cells have this much power. Can you imagine how much power Eve has within her whole body? Meta. Y yes Could you test my cells? Yes, of course, but I want to know. I want to know why I have the power to fight her. I want to know where I stand with her. I, uh, dot dot dot. Please, Maya, I need to know why! My voice acting sucks, I know. Yes, of course. Thanks, Maya. Could you step over here, please? I need you to take off your clothes. I'll need your arm. Like this? Here. Yes, yes. Ow! Let me just set this up here. I think you better see for yourself. What is it? Is something wrong? Again with the super awesome magnification. Get off, get off, bitch, get off. Aya kicks ass at the cellular level. Do you realize what is happening? Your mitochondria are supplying more en energy to the nuclei of your cells. It's almost as if they are protecting the nuclei from Eve's mitochondria. Why does Aya's mitochondria have this kind of power? I don't know, I just... Are you familiar with Richard Dawkins' theory of the selfish gene? In simple terms, it states that genes act in a manner to preserve and ensure survival of the species. Hey man, I don't read those scientific jo- Oh, could have fucking fooled me, Dan. What are you trying to say? Depending on how you look at it, you can say that Eve is trying to destroy all mitochondria except her own. In response to that, Aya's mitochondria have, not has, have, well maybe has depending on his accent, you know, depending on um, how familiar he is and, you know, how his accent and, ah! In response to that, Aya's mitochondria has developed the power to rebel. Why only Aya's? Shouldn't it be the same for us as well? We should also have that power based on... It seems to follow the natural order of things, but I'm sorry, I don't know why. It's Kafka! Grease him! Professor? What are you doing in my lab? This is breaking and entering! Damn straight, we got guns, motherfucker. Why haven't you evacuated the city yet? I'm asking why you people are in my lab! Because you are a stupid motherfucker, that's why. We were just... We received orders to evacuate the city. Professor, you really should. I tell you, cops are the ones corrupting this fine sit. Okay, do, did you miss... What? What? How stupid are you? Dude, have you, like, missed the past couple days? In this game? I, I'm sorry, that was my fault. You see, I asked them to bring me here. Who the hell are you? Oh, I, I am Kunihiko Meida, and I'm a scientist from Japan. You were using my electronic microscope. What? What is this? Where did you get this specimen? 